those who follow the Torah portions are somewhat uh, frustrated that this year is a leap year because in a leap year we insert an extra month, not an extra day as we do on the Gregorian calendar. And because we insert the extra month, our Torah portions that are often combined have their own separate weeks. Thus, we had Tazria last week speaking about leprosy and Mitzorah this week speaking about leprosy. Most people are grateful when they're combined and we do it in one week. I happen to find these Torah portions fascinating and filled with important metaphorical lessons. The ancient rabbis had the same difficulty we do today about relating leprosy to their lives. So they made a metaphor of it and talked about leprosy being symbolic of what happens when we use our tongue for evil, when we gossip, when we slander, when we aren't careful about the words that we say to other people. And this prompted Rabbi Shimon Bar Yochai long ago to say, if I had been at Mount Sinai, I would have asked God to give us two mouths, one for holy speech, studying Torah, sacred notions, the other for the mundane, the meretricious, the everyday directives that we use. We have one mouth, as we know, and so Judaism teaches us to try to use all of our words, all of the ways in which we speak to people as if they're holy words of Torah. This is good advice, not just on special occasions, but every single day of our life. Of course, it's a hard thing to do, but the more we try, the more careful we are with the words that we speak to those around us, especially those closest to us, the more we make the world a better place.